Now, let's go with the part 4, the replay mode. Note that any image or sequence of images can be saved with Color Shades Lab to be reused afterward. To save images, click on the Output button in the upper bar and choose Image Output. The Image Output window, opens on the left column of the screen. First click on the Image Choice button. Then select the images you want to save and their formats. The raw image, the color image and the processed image, can be saved in PNG or TIFF format. The flat field and dark field can be saved in TIFF format only. The single band images, or hyperspectral cube, can be saved in PNG, TIFF, TIFF 9, or, ENVI format. Choose a generic file name. You can add the time and an increasing number to the generic name of the file. Choose the output folder in which the data will be saved. Then you can choose only one image or a sequence of images. The lapse time in between each saved image, can either link to the frame rate, or can be chosen. Then click on the Save One Image button or on the Start button. You can also use the icons One Image, or Acquisition, in the icon bar, to save single images or sequences. Here we save one image. Now, how to use the reply mode. Disconnect physically the camera from your computer. Click on the Source button in the upper bar and choose Replay. The Replay window, opens on the left column of the screen. In the drop-down menu, choose the camera with which the image or the sequence of images to be replayed have been taken. Connect this virtual camera with the Connect Disconnect button. Then, load a image, or a sequence of images. Please note that only the raw images can be used in the replay mode. If you load one image, only select a raw image file. If you load a sequence of images with the load folder button, please note that the folder must only contain raw images. Nothing else. When the raw image is loaded, you can process it in the same manner than explained in the part 3 of this tutorial. The part 5 will conclude this tutorial, flat field. For some applications in which the camera is fixed, to improve the quality of the spectral image, it is relevant to use the flat field correction option. This option allows to correct the non-uniformities of the whole measurement system including the camera and the lighting source. It is particularly suitable for sorting applications. The flat field correction procedure consists in imaging the background of the scene. This background has to be homogeneous. In the following example we place a sheet of white paper under the camera. To apply the flat field correction, first click on the white icon marked FF in the icon bar. Then obturate the camera and CLCK on the black icon marked FF. Then you can apply the flat field correction with the loss icon marked FF. When applied, the color image appear highly homogeneous. The spectrum measurement all over the image is then highly improved. Thank you for your attention. We hope that this tutorial helps you to better understand and use Color Shades Lab. For any additional questions, don't hesitate to contact us.